Hello and welcome to another gaming challenge! You might be wondering why am I playing Super Mario Maker instead of my usual Pokemon challenge? And the reason is quite simple, I have run out of time this week. I've been working, I've been starting my work days earlier than normal, ending them later, and I even worked on Saturday and today on Sunday, which I normally take off, and I still just don't have enough time. That series takes a long time to put together. If I started right now, I probably would not even get it done by midnight, so that's a bit of an issue. So instead, let's play some of this. We're gonna go do a 100 Mario Expert challenge and see how well I can do. Also, a lot of people have asked if I've made levels in this game, and I actually have. I didn't really finish this one, but it's still pretty decent, so here's one level I made, and here's one you should definitely try out called Good Level, and here's Good Level the sequel, so check out that one too. And finally, we have this one right here, so those are a few levels that I've made. Let us go to the 100 Mario Challenge we're going to do Expert, and I guess I'll start a new game here. So the way this works is we have 100 lives, we're gonna play 16 courses, which are considered Expert. The way this decided is basically it means that people that have played these stages have died a lot. So, they might be tough, sometimes they're not as tough as you might think, but let's just drop into it and see what we have. I'm going to try avoid using skips, you can skip levels by pressing a button. If I die like more than 10 times, I'll probably skip it, but I'm not gonna just give up just because it seems a little bit challenging. Can I jump on these fish? I cannot! So I haven't played this game in months, so I've gotta like relearn some of these mechanics. I think I might be able to spin jump on the fishies. Let's find out if that's an option. Uh, well, not if I'm gonna get hit in the face. Alright. Just spin jump on the fish! Is it like a hidden block? Is that gonna be the gimmick? There's gotta be- Oh my gosh, of course there is! That goes my bad knowledge with my, with the game. If only I knew I couldn't jump on firefish, this would have been a lot more straightforward. But there you go! We can go up here, go through the door, and die anyways! Are you kidding me? What the crud? I don't know if that means that this was actually a troll and we do have to jump on the fish, or if there's a different secret path we can take? Okay, what if I just keep going up? Okay, my goodness, we get a gosh dang feather. Are you kidding me? Now, how do I actually... Can I fly from this small of a run? I don't even know if I can fly from this. Let's just see if I can make it with just a jump. And I can get hit by the fish and die. How the crud do I fly from such a small run? Gosh dang it. I'm going to instead try jumping from here and slow falling and see if that'll actually take me all the way. I think this might be the correct solution. I don't know why I jumped down before. Oh my gosh. Oh jeez. Please tell me I can still make it. No, I took extra damage. I might have had to take that damage. I'm not entirely sure, but well, let's move on now. We just have to time our button presses to actually jump on these things properly. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Okay, we've got a lot of fire to dodge here. Please dodge it. No, crud. I think we're gonna make, wow, I didn't see that one. Let me see if I can actually maintain my mushroom this time. Get through there. Gosh dang it, I can't do it fast enough. No. Oh, I mistimed my button press. Great. I made it! Oh my gosh, I made it! And I've got my mushroom. This is awesome. Okay. Now we've got a better chance at living here. Of course, if I jump in the lava like an idiot again, I'm still going to die. So let's not do that. Let's just wait. Be very patient. Alright. Now we can somewhat safely go. Okay, I saw the fireball go up that time. I think that's the one that hit me last time. Oh my gosh! Well, let's just keep going, Mario. Oh! My gosh, how long is this gonna go on for? Of course, there's gosh dang Bowser fire. How did I weave through all of that? Wait, we did it! Oh my gosh, we're at the end. See, that is why you persevere, guys. Sometimes you'll just have an extreme string of fluky luck, I guess, and we made it. And I didn't even spend 10 lives, we're fine. We've only got 15 more courses to try to get through before I lose 91 more lives, and I didn't earn any lives on that one. Course clear, we did it, let's- Oh wow, was I the first person to ever clear that? Or is that- I'm not sure if that means I was the first person to ever clear it, or if that was just my personal first clear, but let's move on to stage number two and see what this one has to offer. From Jeremy, the stage is called Bowser. I am so bad at dealing with Bowser, so this is probably not gonna go well. This time we're playing in some new Super Mario Bro- Oh boy! Go fast! Oh crud! <laughs> well, that didn't go well. Let's be smart this time, guys. We're not gonna just be idiots like that again. What we're going to do is we're gonna trigger that guy. Okay, well, I was kind of dumb again. I lost my mushroom, but I'm just gonna take the top path this time. I wish I could have kept my mushroom along the way. Can I actually safely make that? Uh, I guess so. Man, I would love to have a mushroom right now. Let's just wait for these fires to go by and see if we can make our way up there. Oh my gosh, dude. This is so dangerous. No! <laughs> wow. Okay, we're, we're gonna do the fast strats this time. We're just gonna, we're just gonna go Wow, look how easy that is. That's not even a challenge at all. All right, deal with the fire again. Ugh, very carefully. 
Just don't go too high, Mario. If you go too high, we're going to die. And also make rhymes. Oh, wow! Are you kidding me? Get back up there! Yes! We're back up there. Everything's fine. This is not even... This is not even tough, guys. Oh, gosh. But here's the Bowser they were talking about. Do I go through the door or do I have to jump across? It looks like the door is not going to troll me this time. Oh, Fire Flower! Now let's get our... No! I need that. I need you, Lakitu. Maybe I don't need Lakitu. Okay, I need Lakitu. I need you, Lakitu. Please. No! Wait, he's gonna jump. I can just keep fireballing him. Yes, this is going to work. This is definitely not gonna troll me. Let's just kill this guy. Okay. He's got wings. Oh! Oh, balls. You can't run through these guys. Not on this version. Yes! Go under- No! That was my chance! Can I jump on- You can't jump on Big Bowser. Oh, boy. I'm just gonna take the damage. Let's just go right through, take the damage, don't even care. Just don't hit the saw blades, because if, if we get through here, it doesn't matter if we took the damage. We're gonna get healed back up anyways. Now let's actually get... Lakitu- No! You ran away from me, you crud ball! Gosh dang it. If I could at least kill Bowser Jr., I'd be in a lot better of a situation. Or can I- No, I just- I'm so bad at trying to jump over these guys. I've got to get under him at some point. Oh my gosh. Jump! Fly! Yes! No. <laughs> uh oh Okay, we're gonna get him this time. Yes, we actually got him! Thank goodness we got the gosh dang cloud. Do I want to grab the clown car? I guess I do. So that went a lot better this time. Uh, where am I even trying to get to? I think the end is right here, isn't it? It is! Wow! Okay, we've managed to make it again, guys. This time I think I spent eight lives, so... One better than the first time. Once again, we got no extra lives in the process, though. Let's try stage number three. Of course, number three is Zoic Away by Quilander. Well... Let's see what this crud's gonna try to do to murder us. Gosh dang it. We've got the blue skulls of doom. The blue skulls of death and despair. Don't tell me this is like one of those auto stages. I don't think it is. It doesn't appear to be. Can I take the spring through the door with me? It looks like I can. Maybe I even had to. What the crud is this camera? Game, please. Wait, If I think it's gonna go back up. It's kind of the airship thing that like wobbles back and forth. Uh, let's just... Pretend this is going to work. It actually did! Okay, this is a ridiculous level right here. Where am I going? Do I just have to jump again and hope it works? Alrighty. Please, don't. Nope, that's death. Where the crud am I meant to go? What if I don't take the door? What if I just jump this way? Okay, that's where the door was. And this path down here, what the crud? What the crud? I've got a strange feeling that... The actual level name is somehow a tip for what you have to do, but I can't read that. Is this some kind of secret here that I'm not aware of? Nope, it doesn't seem like there is. There's nothing. Oh my gosh, of course, there's always something, man. There really is always something. So that's the door we came out of. Now we've got a propeller cap. I just gotta get used to that. That's what people love to do in these games whenever they're making levels. Oh my gosh, please don't tell me I missed it. Okay, okay, we can still make this, yes. Okay, we're fine. Everything's okay. We're safe. Let's go grab the door. But every time when people are making levels that are an expert, a lot of the times they're in expert because they're, they troll you. And I think this is one of those times. Do I want the fire flower or do I want to keep this? I guess we're keeping this for safety. Uh, there's a door there. I guess I'm just going to go to the end and grab the flag. All right, we beat it. Take that stage. It says your time and world record, and this time it does not say first clear. So I think the times where it was saying first clear really were like I was the first person to beat those stages. Stage four, Bowser's crazy castle, because we have not had enough Bowser in this already. I don't know why I said enough. It's enough. Enough Bowser. Oh, more flaming fish. Okay, what the heck is this cannon going to do? It's just going to be a bullet bill, regular old bullet bill. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. The question is, do I actually want to get that bomb or do I just want to avoid it? I guess I'm just going to go. Oh, maybe we have to bullet hop here. Okay, that's not too t not too tough. Oh, maybe it is too tough for me. Okay, don't worry about the bomb psycho. Just get the bullet hop and everything will be fine. Bullet hopping? Okay, we're fine. Let's just make it across this crazy jump. We got wizards. Oh, and we got thwomps. We can't spin jump on this version. Uh, go away, Magic Koopa. We gotta let this guy. What the? Oh, I think Magic Koopa might have dropped my block. I don't know what happened there. Let's just try doing the fast. Let's go Speedy Gonzalez right here. Drop that crud. Jump o over the saw blade. There's a saw blade there. What if I just jump over? Go on the bombs. That's what we got to do. We're jumping on the ball. Not going to get trolled this time. Shoot out your stinking Paracoopas. Everything's fine. 
pairs of paracoopas. They're everywhere. The arrow says to go down. Do I trust it? I guess I have to. We've got a crazy spiny guy in a cloud right now. Oh my gosh. All right, let's wait for the fire. I think we're safe down here. I don't think the cloud can get this high. And the fire is not either. Got cannonballs telling me to go up here. The pipe does not help. What if I... Oh, the pipe's just an enemy. Of course. What if I just go like that? That works. Everything's working out all right. I don't think there's fire in this particular spot, so if we just wait for a second, we'll be safe. Now we can drop down. Wait for Mr. Thwomp. I don't think the spike guy can reach me either. Oh gosh, I think I have to jump while it's going up here. Oh, there's another one. Okay, there's a lot more actually. And what am I doing here? We have to go back down. And there's fire. There's spikes in clouds and fire and death everywhere. <laughs> All right, we're back at this crazy spot. Where do I go from here? I guess we just drop down and then go onto the cannons. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh my gosh, I walked at the exact wrong moment. The cannonball bounced me into the lava. Crud. I'm gonna make it this time. We're going to make it. Oh, the fish. The fish. Go away, Mr. Fishy. Oh, it's so much stuff. I'm right there, though. That is the end of the stage. Are you serious? The Magikoopa spawned right there. Not gonna panic. Not gonna freak out. I've lost a lot of lives here, but it really feels like I have a chance, so it makes me want to just keep playing it. I wonder if I can just, like, jump from here. Do I even have to go down there? I'm gonna try, guys. Let's just try doing a suicide jump. Oh, the spike, dude! Are you serious? Oh, we're here again. And the stupid spike guy is really dumb, and I hate him. But can we jump? We cannot. So maybe with, like, super optimal speed you could make that jump, but I, I don't think that's the right way to go about this for me. Yo guys, check out the swag right here. If we jump just like this, boom, boom, oh, oh my gosh. I'm gonna give it one more try at that really hard spot. If we don't beat it, then I'm gonna skip. Never mind, we're just gonna skip it right here because I keep dying. It's kind of gotten to the point where I've gotten impatient with the first part, so I'm dying more than I was before on those easy part uh, parts. This is Mukatsuku, I think. I think I read that right. I don't know what that actually means, but I think that's what it said. So we've got a giant amount of Goombas at the start. Can I fit through there? Oh, of course it's a gosh dang Koopa. Uh, do I need him? Probably not. Uh, probably just means death. Let's not get killed by that again. Let's just jump over this. Find some way to get inside here. Uh, what if I go like, no, what if I just carefully jump like, I think that's the answer. And now we can jump like this. That should let us go up, up and up, up and up, yeah. Now, how do we get over that huge gap down there? Oh, uh, I guess there's, I guess there's safety paths. I, I thought there was a giant amount of piranha plants. There's a mushroom! Don't get the mushroom! Oh gosh, I would not have been able to make it through there. I, I don't think at least. Maybe I could have. Uh, should I have taken the mushroom? What happens if I just jump right here? Wow, okay, that did not seem like a very hard one. See, that's what I was talking about. Sometimes it doesn't really make a lot of sense why things are in expert. I think I actually gained lives on that one. All right, stage number five. I can't believe we're only on five right now. I've been playing for half an hour. Oh, geez. What is this? We've got some kind of game room here. I guess I can jump on top of this. What am I trying to do? I guess we're trying to not get killed by the spring, basically. And it pushes you off, so we've got to be very careful here. What if I... No! Crud! That is exactly what I was trying to avoid. I'm not sure if we have to, like, lead the Goombas along, maybe? Again, I feel like the game, like, the title has something to do with what we actually have to do here. So what if I jump up here, uh, and then we jump up here, now let's wait for this guy, and then go over this way. I think that's going to be what we have to do. Now, can I get the Goombas? I think I might have to sneak in there and grab a Goomba for something, or maybe not. Oh my gosh, let's just sneak inside. The oh, the Goomba's dead. The Goomba is dead, but I think we can use this POW block as a jumping block, right? As long as we just very, very carefully place it. Can you pick it up and jump off of it? No, I, I don't think I can keep it with me. So how in the world do I do this? Uh, can I just like, no! I can just completely bonk it. That works. Wow, we, we've done a great job here. All right, let's see if we can actually go get some Goombas in here. So we can sneak in there and get killed. I'm gonna go ahead and skip this one just because I feel like there's some mechanic that I just don't understand. I haven't played this game in months, so it's probably one that I'll just have to figure out. But anyways, let's skip to the next one. This one is, uh, Oh, jeez. It's been a while since I've read Japanese. I, I, I could probably translate that if I tried, but... Let's... It says to go down? Okay. I, I don't know. The bullets make me want to go up. But I guess we're going to try going down. I'm sure it's not a troll at all. It... It's a troll. Of course. Of course it's a troll. 
See, that's kind of like the anti-game design. Like, whenever... Like, if Nintendo makes a stage and they have an arrow, you're going to want to follow that arrow. If a player makes it, you are going to want to avoid that arrow. All right, so I guess we're just going across. See, oh my gosh. Let's not have that happen. So how are we going to get these bullets to go the right direction here? Now, the question is... Wow, okay, were all of those trolls or just that one particular spot? Oh gosh, oh my gosh, getting all those one-ups at least. Can I jump on blooper? I can. Is it safe down here? Yo! It is safe down here. We got gosh dang clown cars with with uh, stars in them. We just gotta avoid the saw blades. The saw blades will actually stun your car. Not exactly the best thing. So where are we going here? Uh, Please tell me that's it for the stage. Are we done? We're done! Wow, we actually got some extra lives. This one's just called Fight Eye. Or Fight One, maybe? I'm not sure if it's meant to be fight I or fight one, but we've got a fight coming up. Can we get a heal? Or not a heal, a mushroom. Maybe one of these has a mushroom. Maybe it's just not the actual coin block. Nope, none of those are good. So we're just gonna move on. Looks like the fight is gonna be against some gosh dang potaboos. Oh my gosh, wow! How could I not jump? I'm so bad at video games. Don't die by failing to press one button. Good job, Psycho, you've done it. Now we just gotta dodge fire! Okay. Uh, is there gonna be Bowser fire coming up? There is, of course. Or maybe there's just no Bowser. That's just a bridge. Just a bridge. Don't even worry. Now, I think we... Yeah, we can go down this pipe here. Is this going to be a troll pipe? It is not a troll pipe. We're actually safe. How in the world am I alive right now? Okay, we just have another coin block. I hear some Bowser fire coming. I just don't see Bowser fire, but I hear it. There it is. And it's giant. Why can't we just have a small Bowser for a change? Um... Um... Do I want to try and jump over him? I did it! Please tell me that's it. Are we done? We are not done. Uh, that's gonna be a P-switch. Oh, it's gonna kill him. It's gonna kill him. All right, so that's gonna drop down. Can we drop down as well? We can! Oh my gosh, we gotta go. We got falling platforms here. Uh, looks like more Bowser fire, but I think that was just from the one we killed. So through here, we've got a chain chomp. Don't kill me, dude. Oh, we did it! It was our first try. No, I died once. I did die once, but... That wasn't too bad. First clear, hey. Stage number seven. Another long title that I, oh gosh. I'm, uh, I might skip this one. Look at the title, guys. Probably has some kind of clue, but, uh, geez, I can't read all that. Let's just see, can I, can I just hold to the right? No, that's not gonna work. I think we have to go right, hit the switch, and we have to throw the pal block at the same time. What if I just don't grab the pal block? Will that work? Okay, we have to drop that, jump on... No, we have to spin jump off of the P-switch, spin jump onto the spiny, then go up top there. This is ridiculous. Oh my gosh. Oh! I didn't even make it far enough. Wow. P-switch, spin jump... No, that's not a spin jump, you crud! I got it! Yes, we're up there! Oh my gosh. Well, we have a very strict time limit here. How the crud do I get over this guy? Um, excuse me? Excuse me? What the crud? Got it! We're up there. All right, I think I might have to like spin jump when he's down here. I don't exactly know how this is going to work. I think that's how we do this though. Let's wait for that. Oh, there's a gosh dang conveyor belt. What? How? I think I'm really overthinking this, guys. Once he goes to the top, I'm pretty sure there's a small gap where you can get under him. And if you have the conveyor belt going, it's probably not actually that hard. So let me just see if I can time this. Nope. Maybe if I duck. I don't know if ducking actually affects anything when you're small, though. All right. Attempt number two. Yes, we actually made it. We made it past the piranha. How the crud do I get up here now? Oh, dang it. I can't make it, Mario. Make it, you crud. I don't actually know what I'm doing here. But if I... Okay, I think I have to run like this. And that'll almost get me up there. But I don't have much time on the actual clock. Get up there, you crud ball. Dang it, guys. I can't believe this. Oh my gosh, that was it. Yes, we're dead from time up. Yes! No, get up there. You better get up there, you crudder. Urgh, yeah, we're up there. Okay, do I have enough time? Where am I? What? There's a spring. Are you serious? Okay, we've made it this far. If I can just get up there. Yes, Mario, get up there, you crud. Come on, run a little faster. Wow, why is he not getting up there? Thank you. Okay, we're up that far. Just gotta not get killed by the spring here. Where do I go? What the crud do I do from here? Do I have to like spring jump off the side? What the crud? I've got no time for this. Yes, spring jump. Please be, no! I'm gonna give it one more shot, guys, but I think I'm gonna move on. Well, I guess I died there. We're moving on. I said we'll move on after one more. 
I don't know. That's a tough one. I would have died from the time limit anyways last time, even if I made that jump. So, I don't know. But this one's called Airtime by Taser. Uh, looks like we've got plenty of time on the clock this time. Not sure why it's called Airtime. I guess we just have to sneak past. Uh, we made it in time. Sick. Let's just follow these coins. I'm sure they're not going to lead us to our doom or anything like that. Uh, what is that spring for? At least we got enough coins to get an extra life. Okay, right here we get a mushroom, which we needed to break the thing. Great! Okay, I'm not gonna miss it this time. Yeah, we're up there. Let's just dodge bullet bill, dude. And then we'll try to start breaking these blocks right here. That's the good time. Come on, get up there. Yep. Yeah. Let's see. Yep, yeah, we can squeeze under here. We get ourselves a fire flower. Is that something I actually need? If I can get up there and get it. Yes! Let's go find out if this is useful. Just dodge past you. Okay, we're up there. Uh, once again, I've got some... Oh, the Koopa! I needed him. Gosh dang it. Alright, how about I don't kill the Koopa this time? That sounds like a great idea. So let's just wait for this guy. We're gonna jump on him, smack him to the side, get out of the way, and hopefully not get killed by this crud. I think that might be all we need. Let's see if it'll break any more for us. It will, so we'll just let it break as much as it can, and then we'll go ahead and kill it right here. Hopefully that was not important to keep with us for some reason. So let's go up here, and yeah, looks like we can just break through here ourselves. If I can actually squeeze through that. Yes! Yes! Alright, Mr. Koopa, I'm not going to kill you, hopefully. Let's just wait, jump on him, smack him. And now we wait. Oh boy. Wait for a little bit longer. Two more blocks. And last one coming up here. Please don't be a troll. And we're good. So we kill that guy off. And now we can make it through. We've got some bullet hopping to do, or I don't know if it's bullet dodging, bullet hopping. Oh boy. I'm still alive. I still have my fire flower. Oh, get in there. Get in there. Get, oh my gosh, get the crud. Oh my, what if I make a little distance? No, nope, don't get killed. Oh my golly, just get some distance. The springs are very difficult to spring off of when they're cl uh, close together like that, but we've made it. Now we just have to wait for these guys. Don't get shot at by bullet bills now, Mario. I think everything's fine, guys. This is actually a pretty relaxing stage from this point, it seems. So everything's going just totally swell. And I get another mushroom here that I don't actually need. I've managed to hold on to this. Wow. So we break through this guy, and I don't know if that's a split path. I guess it is. We have to crouch. Get up in there. Oh, jeez. Uh, yeah, it looks like a dead end up there. So we're just gonna go this way. And Goomba? Is Goomba important? Uh, let me go ahead and bullet hop here. Let's get some good running speed. Jump. Bounce on that guy! Where am I going? Am I going to die? No, I've made it! I guess that's what you had to do. I'm not sure if I skipped part of the stage or what happened there, but... Well, whenever I've done it, it's worked! And we've got spinies. I'm not gonna grab that flower. Let's just avoid it for now. Oh gosh, no, you crud! Okay, what I'm going to do is get the cloud. I'm gonna go back down, get the flower. No, don't lose the cloud! Don't lose the... Okay, keep the cloud. Put the cloud over there. You know what? Screw it. I don't need the flower. I'm not gonna go back for it. Just gotta get over this before the cloud vanishes. This thing will run out in just a few seconds. Please tell me I've had a... I guess I should not have gone back for the flower. You know what guys, I've only got 10 lives left. This level's kind of boring. Let's move on and see if we can get some more variety. Actually, I've got 11 lives. No, we got 10. We've got 10 lives left. More Japanese levels. Oh, we've got an actual water level. It's, I don't think we've had any of these so far. So let's grab this guy. What are we doing with this? There's a power block over there. I can't go inside the door. Uh, can I get rid of this guy? Probably not. I think I have to go inside with the spike helmet, grab the bomb. Nope, that doesn't work at all. I was really hoping to avoid a puzzle level, and it looks like I have not managed to do so. I don't know if I can grab the shell from the side and maybe throw it at it, and see if that'll actually hit the P-switch. No! Gosh dang it, if you push down, it equips it. Uh... Start over. So the question becomes, can I swim down without equipping it? I think I can, as long as I don't accidentally hit the side of the platform. So now we can just go down. Yes. No! As soon as you hit the floor, it equips it. Gosh dang it. Start over. All right, so we go up here. We grab the thing. We have to go down. What if I just throw it here? Oh my. We go up here. We grab the thing. We very carefully avoid the donut and go down. Then we throw it and not get killed. I think I have to throw it and swim back up because if I go down to the floor, then bad things happen. Very carefully grab it, Mario. What if I throw it like this? Yes, that's gonna work. Okay, so that goes and hits that and that does nothing. 
Oh my gosh, that does nothing. I have no idea why I thought that would go through the spring, but basically I'm really dumb. Right, so what if I grab this again? That didn't work, right? So what if I grab this, go down, and swim under here without equipping it? Then we go up this way, and I throw it at the bomb. Now that kills the bomb and does nothing. What the crud? Let's see, can I just sneak in there, grab the bomb without getting stuck? Is that a possibility? I don't think it is. No, I think we will get stuck if we try to go in there for that, so... I don't think that's the answer. I think we have to somehow blow up the bomb to make him break those blocks down there. I might be able to use the donut to go inside the door. That's all I can think of now. Okay, go, 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 go! Yes! That is the answer! I cannot believe that's how you do it. Oh my gosh. But now I think we need the shell, don't we? Oh, what we need to do is... Okay, we take the helmet inside just like that. We bonk the muncher to throw it up, and that'll free up the cannon. The cannon's gonna shoot something at this. We can grab something from there, and... I think that's what we have to do. I've only got one more shot. No, two more shots at this, so I gotta make them count. There was just mechanical things. I didn't know we could use the donut to go in like that. I'm glad I found it, but it might be too little too late. But let's find out. Let's just go down here. We're gonna bonk this guy out of the way. And that should free up the cannon to shoot a P-switch. Yes! So now we can hit the P-switch and go inside here. If I can manage to squeeze inside, that'll give us a Yoshi. Now Yoshi, I think he can eat the muncher, can't he? Uh, he cannot eat munchers, but he could probably eat the bomb. Or that I can just use him to go inside here. Yeah, how do I go inside? I might have to get another P-switch, actually. Alright, so we get another P-switch here. Let's have Yoshi eat that. Let's have him spit it out over there. And we'll see if we can actually get that to use as a stepping ladder, basically. Okay, lined up perfectly. Now let's use that to go back through. Yes, the P-switch worked perfectly. So now we have that. Now we have to use Yoshi. Can we sneak through here with Yoshi, though? I think we have to, right? Oh my gosh, somehow I've done it. Somehow I have done it. So we get Yoshi through there. Now I think I have to get the POW block and shoot it at... Oh, what the crap? I can just eat the spring. Are you kidding me? Okay. Can I get the POW block? Yes, I can. So we get the POW block and then we shoot it at this guy. Oh, we got, got rid of the bomb. Crud. And now this shoots fire. This is my last try and I've got to be completely honest, I'm a little bit stumped. Will the bomb explode if I just eat it with Yoshi and then spit it back out? No, he just swallows it! Gosh dang it, that was my last life, guys. Well, if you happen to know the solution to this puzzle, let me know. Go ahead and post it down in the comments, but I guess that is it for me, guys. I don't think there's any way I can continue here. I just, I haven't played this game in so long, I've forgotten how can I make the bomb explode, but... Oh well, guys, we didn't really even beat, like, half this challenge, but... That's what we're gonna call things here, because I am now dead, so... I guess we're, we're done. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this challenge, even though it's not what we were supposed to be doing this weekend. I thought it would be fun to do some Super Mario Maker finally, because I haven't really done any. But that's it, guys. I'll see you next time. Take care!